let's not just start labeling people cheap shot artists and people that are taking people out because I don't think that's accurate. With that being said, <laughs> this Colorado State kid. Uh, mm -hmm. Yeah. He's a Buddy, you see this? They got police involved because there's death threats happening to him and everything like that. Travis Hunter came out and was like, it's just football. Hey, he's just making a football play. We all saw what he did on that hit. Mm -hmm. okay? yeah. He goes around his guy. <laughs> Ball clearly out, goes around his guy, and certainly lays a shot. Now, if he was on your football team, I think everybody would say, okay, a little dirty, but, you know, their best guy, Travis Hunter, he hit him. Now, he lacerates his liver, yeah. I do believe, which is on his right side, out three weeks. And then at the end, he gets shaken out of his shoes for a touchdown. I, th death threat's interesting. People are, people are asking for him to be, like, expelled from yeah, Colorado. Over him a little bit. Huh? Every, Don't you think part of it's how he stood over him a little bit? Yeah, That's flexing it, on him. It, it clearly late. Cle clearly, yes, very late. Definitely late. But, yeah, if this was on your team, I would assume, yeah, oh, yeah, we get the penalty, but he probably shouldn't be thrown out of the game is what probably you would say if he's on your team. Yeah, but I'm thinking, get him, yeah, target. Mm -hmm. Oh, if he's if he's not on my team, I'm – Freaking out. Say, this guy, get him, <laughs> well, out, get him the hell out of here. Yeah, yeah for sure. Here. There's people saying he needs to be expelled, uh, <laughs> yeah. kicked out of the entire thing. And I assume there's people telling him that he needs, you know, to potentially pass away because of that whole thing. That's why cops are getting involved. I would like to say I'm one of the largest team Colorado guys of all time. I appreciate and respect Travis Hunter's answer where he said, like, hey, this yeah. is just football. Guy certainly should have been ejaculated. Yeah. Uh, right. That's how a couple people phrased it yep. and worded it on X. You know, <laughs> they said, need to ejaculate this guy. Yeah. Somebody very serious was saying yeah. instead of ejecting they were saying oh, yeah, like, get him out right now were they serious oh yeah, oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, they're oh, so yeah. bad uh -huh. autocorrect so bad they're autocorrect I don't know what he's been typing bingo yeah why does it go oh, to ejaculate I, I don't know why his smartphone is like we know where you're at homie yeah. as soon as he gets the EJ we got it we know where we're headed straight to ejaculation city y'all doing too much now bro terrible play call you should have been ejaculated as soon as I seen that hit I would ejaculate him. Uh -huh. But to say he's banned for competing in college football area is crazy, dog. Y'all acting soft. It's like, oh, we man. agree with some Yeah. <laughs> some of that. Uh, now, as a journalism show, sure. mm -hmm. yep. we will say we do not believe he meant ejaculated. I don't know. So. I don't think so. We used it twice, though. I mean, he used it twice. Yeah. Well, well, that's his phone. He needed to get it off. Yeah, his they, phone was like, I got you. Yeah, I got he did. You. We know that. Maybe they yeah. wanted, he maybe wanted to use like sandpaper. See? See, that's your problem. That's what? your problem. Mm -hmm. You just couldn't wait to hear me say that guy wanted to get his ex off. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> that's all he wanted oh. to do. Post an ex. I don't, I'm not sure what happened. I don't know. What are you talking about? Well, you were talking about ejaculation. Yeah, exactly. This and guy's talking off. about ejected. We have to back. Do you have the little red squiggly lines if you're trying to post that before you go out there? Wouldn't your autocorrect like, do that? No, no ejaculate is spelled correctly. Oh, yeah. That, is, yeah. Yeah. that is correct yeah, spelling yeah. of yeah. ejaculate. I'm going to do context of where it is, I guess. The blue squiggly line. Is, and, in yeah. his, and in his brain, there's an EJ, there's, there's, a, there's a C, there's yeah. a T, right. yeah. It's all his, in there. His brain just saw it, and his phone was like, we know. Boom. Mm -hmm. We know what you are talking about, sir. Mm -hmm. Sir German, German Jesty. Yeah. What was his name? Yeah, that's so. Jesty. Yeah, German Jesty. People were mad at that kid, though. I mean, people. German Jesty Jackson. I get it. It's kind of how he flexed on him afterwards, yeah. too. Doesn't help at all. Yeah. yeah. And also with the coach, the way the coach was talking. Yeah. And that, whole, that, that whole game was. That game uh, both ways was was uh, very, very chippy. Little chip. Oh, yeah. I don't like, just as a um, an analyst of the sport. I don't like the Shador's the guy that gets got to go fight him. Yeah, yeah. interesting. You know, I didn't appreciate because yeah. that's on Colorado sideline. Right? Mm -hmm. yeah, so that guy hits him late, goes around his guy, hits him late, flexes on him. Mm -hmm. Right, the discipline of the sideline, I respect. No penalties. Yep. Yeah, we're gonna do that. But nobody until Shador sprints down the yeah. field in his in his face. I like the fact that your best players are your biggest dogs. That's yep. good news. But also, like, huh? Yeah. Huh? Somebody. Right, I mean, yeah. Shador, the Heisman yeah. is, has to be the guy. Needs more up there a little quicker, and that was, that's one of the position groups. Coach Prime said, "Hey, need some more dogs in here." So I'm, I'm sure they'll, they they probably talked about it. Like like uh, Tone said, that game was chippy even before kickoff, oh, yeah. and obviously with the comments with uh, Colorado State's coach, who they played a hell of a game too. Hell of a game. He uh -huh. had his guys probably all 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 jacked up uh, before the game, but um, you know that hit it, once again. It's part it's part of football. Was it dirty? Was it late? Yes. But it was a chippy game. You expect, it. especially when when it's the when it's Travis Hunter, a guy that important to the team. Just like we go into certain games, hey, 
this quarterback, we want to touch this quarterback. Every play, this running back, this receiver, we want to touch him. So I get it. I don't think anything should have been more done. I don't want to throw myself into the story, but this show is named after me, and I do a lot of the talking on this mm -hmm. show. Uh, there was one team where their special teams coach actually had them every kickoff. I had somebody come hit me. And it was like, why are you doing this? Why, excuse me, why are you blocking? There's other people to block right here. They're like, oh, yeah, today we were told, like, to get some hands on you. Gotcha. And I was like, these assholes are driving me right now. Yeah. What do you, you think? I'm going to get scared out here. And then a punt, I hit a punt, and I'm jogging on the field. This guy right on my left side just hitting me. I'm like, man, I'm going to have to do well here today because if I don't do well here today, Guess what's coming? Yeah. Every, Every single week. game, I'm mm -hmm. going to have somebody on me. It's like Travis Hunter knows mm -hmm. that there's going to be – I assume he knows. Oh, yeah. He's been taught that, yeah. hey, you're the guy on the team. There's going to be some teams that are going to choose to take a little bit more mental warfare with you. What's the mental warfare? A uh, couple extra shots. Yep. While you're down, people are going to get up mm -hmm. off of you. Mm -hmm. Like just little things within the game. Now, that was definitely a cheap shot. We are not saying – For sure. That was not a cheap shot. But, like, that has been in football – for a long time, it sucks where the hit happened, mm -hmm. the injury that took place, because that could be lethal. Yeah. I yeah. looked it up. I didn't know what a liver laceration was. I was like, damn, how's that happen? Underneath the right ribs, I guess, is where the liver is, you know, because in boxing, that's where you're trying oh, yeah. to mm -hmm. liver shots. But yep. uh, it can go from like moderate severity to like lethal severity. So I don't know what the liver does, but I guess if it's lacerated, could be a problem inside the body. Yeah, big one. Happy he's okay. Did his podcast already.